It was stunning. I heard the popping sounds and I wasn't sure what happened. That is Illinois senior senator revealing today that he came dangerously close to a shooting on Lakeshore Drive. Of course, Democrat Dick Durbin, the second most powerful senator on Capitol Hill. He talked about this here as he announced a $2 million anti-violence grant. Our political editor, Mike Flannery, joins us now to explain what happened here. This is frightening. Yeah. I, I, it... It's too yes. much. <laughs> Guys, uh, Durbin said he and his wife Loretta were returning to their north side apartment from a dinner downtown when a man in the vehicle right next to theirs on Lakeshore Drive suddenly opened fire. And sadly, that's what happens way too often. There was just a report on the news that we're going to get extra help from state police and others to deal with these vehicular shootings and the people who are victims. But there are lots of people we know who aren't that lucky. Former President Obama's senior White House advisor David Axelrod tells me on tonight's edition of Flannery Fired Up that the time is long past due for Mayor Lightfoot to declare a public safety emergency here. He noted the FBI's report that killings spiked 56 percent in Chicago last year. They're now higher still so far this year with more than 3,500 people shot, more than 650 shot dead. And it requires the mayor to do what mayors don't like to do, which is to say, this is a, this is, this is more than we can handle here at city government. We need everyone at the table. We've got a public safety emergency. If not, you know, this is going to be on her account uh, if she runs for re-election in 2023. So you think uh, Axelrod and Senator Durbin have had it with this crap? Uh, both men, by the way, had praise today for the Chicago Cred Anti-Violence Program, one run by Arne Duncan, the former Secretary of Education in the Obama administration. Axelrod says the program and others like it must be scaled up enormously to reach the 20,000 young men that some believe are both the perpetrators and victims at the heart of Chicago's pandemic of violence. I'm Fox 32 Chicago's disgusted political editor Mike Flannery.